Ooh, I love tortellini, fresh stuffed pasta. Okay guys, so I'm gonna show you two of my favorite ways of preparing fresh tortellini. Tortellini cooked in a butter and sage sauce and fried tortellini. It's kind of like chips. They're so addictive, you can't stop that one. Beautiful, they're filled with minced mortadella, prosciutto, cotto, or ham, a little bit of parmigiano, some egg and nutmeg. And even raw, these are delicious. Oh, look at that filling. Heat up some vegetable oil. So the oil is nice and hot. Now I'm gonna get the tortellini and just put them on a spider spoon and in it goes to the hot oil. Okay, these are getting nice and golden. And when they're done, remove them and drain them on a paper towel. And I'm just gonna keep going, frying them all up. Okay, and then the rest right on, just continue, the oil's nice and hot still. And these with a glass or two of amarone, fantastic. Okay, look at this. Fried tortellini, amarone. Takes me right back to Verona. Mm. It's like the perfect aperitivo. Okay guys, I showed you how the fried tortellini were prepared raw tortellini that's fried, basta stop. And I have some fresh tortellini here. Now I'm gonna show you, I think the best sauce for tortellini. Water's boiling, tortellini take no time at all to cook, probably about two, three minutes. They come to the top and they're ready. Now I'm gonna make our sauce, butter. And guys, remember, always unsalted butter. Unsalted, okay. I don't even understand why people use salted. Exactly. You're put in the sage leaves and just let that butter melt. Water is boiling and I'm gonna add in the tortellini and give them a little stir so they don't stick. Oh my God, Emma, check out the butter. Look at that. How does that look, Ems? Smells good. Smells good. Okay, so I'm gonna turn off the heat, okay, because the butter's melted. We don't want it brown. We just want it melted and we're gonna then finish it with Parmigiano. Okay, tortellini are looking good. They're, they've almost come to the top, all of them. So just a couple of minutes. Okay, and you know when they start floating to the top, they're done. They're like jellyfish, <laughs> like coming up to the top. Okay, we're just gonna put this in. Oh yeah. And some of the pasta water is gonna get in as well. That's exactly what you want. Now I'm just gonna put half in the bowl, and then the other half M's, I'm gonna put in with the butter. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Now look at this. Oh yeah. Look at this M's. Okay. Okay. It's buttery. Oh yeah. It's all butter. Oh yeah. And now M's, what are we gonna put? Parmigiano. Brava, brava, parmigiano reggiano. Well then again, it's the only ingredient left. <laughs> oh, look at that, Ems. Bellezza. Na bellezza, Ems. Na bellezza. Oh my God, butter, sage, parmigiano, na bellezza. It's parmigiano now. Okay, just a little bit on top. The cherry on top of yeah. an ice cream sundae. And then, then this is not ice cream. Un po' di olio nuovo. This is the, this year's olive oil.
I'm back in Emilia Romagna. I'm back in Bologna. Try them with it. Really? Yeah, really. Really? These are a tradition, the old switcheroo. Aww. Dad, you shouldn't have. Yeah, you're right, I shouldn't have. There'd be more for me. <laughs>